Hello, Robocop 1987 is a classic TV series that I'm sure most of our listeners are familiar with. Today, we'll reminisce and review this series with the entire cast from back then and now. We'll provide you with the original names and ages of the actors in the show and how they've changed in 2023. Let's take a look. Alex Murphy, portrayed by the talented actor Peter Weller, is the central character in the series. Peter Weller, born on June 24, 1947, in Stevens Point, Wisconsin, was 40 years old when he took on this role. Murphy is a dedicated police officer critically injured and later transformed into the crime-fighting cyborg known as Robocop. Weller's performance combined humanity with the precision of a machine, creating an enduring symbol of justice and relentless vengeance. Currently, Peter Weller is 76 years old and is celebrated for his contributions to the science fiction genre and cinema as an unbeatable Robocop. Dick Jones, portrayed by the talented actor Ronnie Cox, is an important character in the series. Ronnie Cox, born on July 23, 1938, in Cloudcraft, New Mexico, was 48 years old when he played this role in the series. Dick Jones is a high-ranking executive at Omni Consumer Products, the corporation responsible for creating Robocop. He serves as the primary antagonist, using power and ruthlessness to further his personal interests. Ronnie Cox delivered a memorable performance as a corporate villain, making Dick Jones an icon in the world of cinematic antagonists. Currently, Ronnie Cox is 85 years old and remains a respected figure in the entertainment industry. Johnson, portrayed by the talented actor Felton Perry, is a supporting character in the series. Felton Perry, born on January 11, 1945, in Chicago, Illinois, was 42 years old when he played this role in the series. Johnson is a high-ranking official at Omni Consumer Products, the company behind the creation of Robocop. He is part of the leadership within the company and oversees the Robocop project. Felton Perry's performance added depth to the corporate world depicted in the series, portraying a character grappling with moral dilemmas surrounding advanced law enforcement technology. Today, Felton Perry is 78 years old and is honored for his diverse acting career in the industry. S, portrayed by the talented actor Lee DeBru, was born on July 30, 1941, in Los Angeles, California, and was 46 years old when he played this role in the series. S is a fraudulent steel mill owner involved in unlawful activities. His character serves as one of the first adversaries that Robocop has to confront in his journey for justice. Lee DeBru brought a reliable mix of menace and cunning wisdom to the role. Currently, Lee DeBru is 82 years old and continues his active career in film and television, leaving a mark in both movies and TV. Bob Morton portrayed by the talented actor Miguel Ferrer, was born on February 7, 1955, in Santa Monica, California, and was 32 years old when he played this role in the series. Bob Morton is a young and ambitious executive at Omni Consumer Products, playing a crucial role in the competition with Dick Jones for the creation of Robocop. Miguel Ferrer's charismatic and passionate performance depicted a character driven by ambition, ultimately leading to unforeseen consequences. Sadly, Miguel Ferrer passed away peacefully at his home on January 19, 2017, at the age of 61, but he is still remembered for his significant contributions to the science fiction genre.
Anne Lewis, portrayed by the talented actress Nancy Allen, is an important character in the series. Nancy Allen, born on June 24, 1950, in New York City, was 37 years old when she played this role. Anne Lewis is a strong and dedicated police officer who works alongside Robocop. She is a crucial ally to the main character, providing support and camaraderie in the chaotic future of Detroit. In 2023, Nancy Allen is 73 years old and is honored for her significant contributions to the film industry, especially in the science fiction and action genres. Leon Nash, portrayed by the talented actor Ray Wise, was born on August 20, 1947, in Akron, Ohio, and was 40 years old when he played this role in the series. Leon Nash is a ruthless and brutal criminal, a member of the gang led by Clarence Boudicca. The character of Nash played a significant role in the film's plot, especially in memorable action sequences. Currently, Ray Wise is 76 years old and is still a respected figure in the entertainment industry, known for his versatility in film and television over many years. Clarence Bodecker, portrayed by the talented actor Kurtwood Smith, was born on July 3, 1943, in New Lisbon, Wisconsin, and was 44 years old when he played this role in the series. Clarence Bodecker is a violent and ruthless criminal, leading a gang involved in heinous acts. Kurtwood Smith's performance was terrifying and intense, turning Bodecker into one of the most iconic villains in the history of cinema. Today, Kurtwood Smith is 80 years old and is honored for his enduring career in the film and television industry, including his unforgettable role in Robocop. Sergeant Hedgecock, portrayed by the talented actor Michael Gregory, was born on August 26, 1944, in Brooklyn, New York, and was 43 years old when he played this role in the series. Sergeant Hedgecock is an investigative police officer who works alongside Lewis and other members of the Detroit Police Department. Although his role was relatively small, Michael Gregory's performance added authenticity to the police force scenes in the film. Currently, Michael Gregory is 78 years old and has had a career that includes various roles in film and television. Emil Antonowski, portrayed by the talented actor Paul McCrane, was born on January 19, 1961, in Philadelphia, Pennsylvania, and was 26 years old when he played this role in the series. Emil is a member of Clarence Bodecker's gang, known for his unique laughter and erratic behavior. This character played a significant role in the depicted criminal activities in the film. As of 2023, Paul McCrane is 62 years old and continues to work in the film industry, making a mark in both movies and television over many years. Sergeant Reed, portrayed by the talented actor Robert Duke, was born on April 20, 1934, in Stillwater, Oklahoma, and was 53 years old when he played this role in the series. Sergeant Reed is a seasoned and commanding officer directly in charge of Alex Murphy, Robocop. He is depicted as a down-to-earth and dedicated law enforcement officer in the crime-ridden Detroit. Robert Duke's portrayal added authenticity to the harsh and tumultuous world of Robocop. Unfortunately, Robert Duke passed away on February 9, 2008, peacefully at the age of 73, 
leaving a legacy of memorable roles in film and television. The Old Man, portrayed by the talented actor Dan O'Herlihy, was born on May 1, 1919, in County Wexford, Ireland, and was 68 years old when he played this role in the series. The Old Man is a mysterious and influential CEO of Omni Consumer Products, OCP, the corporation behind the Robocop project. His character represents the business interests driving the creation of the crime-fighting cyborg. Dan O'Herlihy's dignified performance added depth to the film's commentary on corporate ethics. Unfortunately, he passed away in Malibu, California, in 2005 at the age of 85. The Bail Bondsman, portrayed by Charles Carroll, is a small but memorable character in the series. Charles Carroll born on May 12, 1952, in Los Angeles, California, USA, was 35 years old when he played this role. The Bail Bondsman is a rough and no-nonsense character with brief interactions with Emil Antonowski, one of the criminals. While his role was minor, Charles Carroll's performance added authenticity to the world of crime and turmoil depicted in Robocop. Currently, Charles Carroll is 71 years old. Who is your favorite character in the series? Please share your thoughts and feelings in the comments section below, and don't forget to turn on notifications to be the first to know when new content is released. Thank you.